Hello, brave, beautiful, beloved soul friends. I hope you're doing well. I have a healing journey game for you guys today. All you're going to need is a piece of paper and a pen or some kind of writing utensil. Okay. It's a really simple, really fun game. Okay. So the intention of this game is to let yourself break the illusion of rules so that you can freely and playfully and lightheartedly be all of yourself. Okay. So you've got pen and a piece of paper. So what you're going to do is you're going to draw a really big circle on this paper, big enough to fit your whole hand in. So you'll make a nice big circle on this piece of paper, okay? And then on the piece of paper, inside of the circle, you'll write in large capital letters, do not press, okay? So you've got a piece of paper, big giant circle with all capital letters that says do not press. Then you're going to hold that paper up against something, and you're going to press it with your whole hand. It's a do not press button and you are pressing it and there is something so profoundly satisfying about pressing a button that says do not press. It's very inner child liberation-y. It's very magical. It's very liberating. Like, like there's this rule, there's this thing that everyone says I have to do. There's this, there's this limitation, there's this restriction. And I'm gonna say, you know what? Screw that. I'm gonna be me and have fun. <laughs> Let's do it again, ready? Always more for the parts in the back. <laughs> <laughs> in that process, you're creating space to break subconscious conditioning to liberate yourself because our subconscious mind carries all these restrictions and all these concepts about what should be and what shouldn't be and who we should be and who we shouldn't be. And they're all just illusions. And who you really are is always perfect and always enough and who you are meant to be. And the more we shatter the illusions, the more we liberate ourselves into who we really are. And the more free that we are, the better life becomes the better life becomes. All the things that make life feel bleh is really just a clue that this isn't who we really are. Think about that. All the stuff that makes life go bleh, uh, uh, whether it's anger or anxiety or frustration or worry or anything, feeling like you have to walk on eggshells around other people, feeling like you're not joyful in whatever it is that you're doing. Anything that's not like totally vibing with like massive awesomeness is just a clue that, hey, this isn't who we really are. And this is something to process through and shatter illusions so that we can be liberated into more of our true selves. And so like as silly and simple and succinct as this game is, it holds really deep subconscious impact. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? So just take a piece of paper, draw a big circle, right? Do not press. It becomes a button, a button that represents all of the things that you think you're not supposed to do, all the things you think you're not supposed to be, all the things you think are impossible. And then you're like, ah! maybe it's just an illusion and I can press the button anyways. <laughs> Something very, very fun and satisfying about pressing a button that says do not press. So you create a button for yourself and feel free to play with it. Obviously you can have fancy text. You can put stickers around it. You can really like make it your own, right? So you got this button and you go and you press it and you keep it handy and you make this like a regular practice. And every single time you do it, you watch what happens. Watch what happens. Here's the like the advanced technique to like go deeper than just it being a game. Watch what happens to your own unconscious body mind when you press the button that says do not press. Okay, so you're looking at it. Your eyes are seeing do not press in like really big bold letters. Okay, so you're seeing that. So your subconscious is saying, okay, I see that. It says not to press it. And then you go and you press it. Watch what comes up for you. It can be like a magical game to catalyst introspective liberation. Who knows what can who knows what can come from playing games? Okay? So you press that button and see what comes up for you. See what comes up. Maybe there's tension in your body or maybe you erupt in laughter. But just see what comes up for it and use it as a catalyst to understand yourself deeper. And the more that you understand yourself, to use those insights to amplify the power and the magic of your healing journey. Okay? So do not press, give it a good button press and have fun liberating your inner child and know that there is more to life than we can see. There is more magic to be discovered in the unknown. There is more wonder in breaking beyond the illusions of 
fear or limitation or whatever might be stopping us from being all that we really are deeper within. And a lot of times we don't even realize how much we're restricting ourselves until we start to feel the power of loving liberation. Once we start to feel those higher vibrations of just joy and ecstasy and wonder and excitement and marvel and awe and just, I can't wait to do this. I can't, I can't wait to exercise. I can't wait to eat food. I can't wait to go to bed at night. I can't wait to wake up in the morning. I can't wait to express myself. I can't wait to read or write. I can't wait to do this. Until we start to feel that in every activity, there's still something blocking us from who we really are. Because that type of vibrant ecstasy is our natural state as divine consciousness flowing through a miraculous sacred vessel. That really is our natural state. And anything that does not fully feel like that is a clue that there's something blocking us from who we really are. So... Use the do not press button game to liberate your inner child and catalyst deeper self-understanding. I love you guys. I hope you have a beautiful and blessed day. And please do feel free to check out all of my other mystical, magical content. YouTube.com slash Kristen Chronicles here has a bunch of stuff. um, Pretty magical, cool stuff. And then my website has a whole bunch of magics. KristenWindsor.com. And from that, you'll see all the different uh, services and product creations I offer. But there's also a lot of free magics too. KristenWindsor.com slash gifts has a bunch of free stuff you can download. Some videos you can see. um, A lot of playbooks. There's a few new ones even. They're super magical and super fun. I've been using them and they get better every single time. Uh, KristaWindsor.com slash known has a magnificent documentary series. Uh, It shares my personal story and the Implicit Revelations case study with uh, dozens of theses, statements, and in-depth analysis shared through video and text. Um, there's a whole bunch of magic, so please do feel free to browse all the different options. Uh, there's a bunch of different pages on my website at kristawindsor.com. And if you'd ever like to connect one-on-one through a consciousness consultation, that is the favorite of all my magics that I offer. It would be a sacred honor to connect with you through an audio or video call. I hope you have a beautiful and blessed day, and I'm so proud of you for embracing your magical, miraculous healing journey. And I will see you in some other video or content creation. Blessings, soul friends. Namaste. The love and light in my divine consciousness. See and honor the love and light in your divine consciousness. Infinite blessings, beloved beings.